Hey guys, welcome back or welcome if you're new here. My name is Kaibi and today I'm going to show you guys how to use a Lightroom in Blender. In this video, I'm going to be using Alex's Lightroom as an example, but this will basically work for any kind of Lightroom. Having that said, if you don't actually have a Roblox Lightroom yet, then I do recommend making this your default one. So without further ado, let's get into it. Firstly, you're going to want to go to Alex's video and you're going to want to go into the description and you're going to want to go to the media fire and download and then save it wherever. Next, you're going to want to make sure that you have WinWar or 7-Zip or something that can unzip the RAR file. So if you don't know how to do that, make sure to watch tutorials on YouTube. There are a bunch. So once you've done that, what you want to do is you want to right click on the RAR folder and you're going to want to extract it. You can close out of the file app and then open Blender. Then you're going to want to load up your rig. This is the ultimate rig, but I also do have a tutorial on how to use Alex's rig as well. So that will be linked in the description. Next, you want to go to file and then append. And you want to locate that folder that you extracted. And you're gonna to wanna to double click and then double click the blend file. And then you're going to want to select collection, select the Lightroom collection and then append. Hi. So now we have the Lightroom in here. And if you go into the rendered shading mode, oh my God, beautiful. you can see that it's already working. I went ahead and loaded the materials and the accessories so you can see what the Lightroom does better. So now once we go into shading mode, we can see it a little bit more clearly. Now if you don't like the colored lights or you want a different color, it's pretty easy to do. Just go to the Lightroom and then click the down arrow, click the down arrow on lights, click the down low arrow on plane, and then you will see these. So the ones that have colors is the black and the warm and the cold. So all you need to do to change these is just to click on the color right here and you can change the value you can change the hue and you can change the saturation so for me i'm going to try changing this one to a red i'll change the warm i'll keep the warm the same and i'll change the cold to a yellow now once we render we can see that the colors have changed and if you don't want any color, then you can always just turn down the saturation and it will just be white. Now all you have to do is do your usual routine, render the image as usual, and you'll have a well-lit character. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If it did help, make sure to click that like button. If you want more tutorials or videos like this, then make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on post notifications to know when I post. If you want me to do any specific video, then make sure to comment down below and suggest it. And with that being said, I hope you guys have a great day. Bye-bye!